For this example, we have a system of linear inequalities and we want to graph the solution region. Here is one inequality in my system and I have already graphed it. It is less than or equal to, so a solid boundary line, and I've shaded the half plane where the true solutions lie to this inequality. Now let's work on the second inequality of our system, y greater than or equal to 2. Remember, first you graph y is equal to 2. Graph the corresponding equation. If you will recall, this line, the graph of y is equal to 2, is a horizontal line through 2 and I will draw it in as a solid line. Now do not concentrate on the other graph on this system right now. Simply concentrate on this horizontal line and I want to shade all numbers greater than or equal to 2 for y values. So where would that lie? That would lie above this horizontal line y values are greater than or equal to 2 above the horizontal line. So just this inequality, I shade above. Now the solution region for this system is where the two shaded regions intersect. So where do the two shaded regions intersect? Not here. Neither is shaded here. Only one is shaded here. Only one here. But can you see that in this area right here, both regions are shaded, and here is the solution region.